Hello and welcome to a DLVR tutorial. We will be talking about the Canon RF52 uh, dual fisheye lens. And what we offer at DLVR is that you keep the footage as it is. So no more uh, stereo corrections, no stitching. You just do your edit, your, co your color correction on the actual footage and render it out as it is. We would like to also show you a neat trick to remove the lenses, so let's do this first. Uh, I imported here the footage and I made like a single frame image, so we will work faster. So let's start with a 3D comp and we need to duplicate the footage and let's check what we will do. So you can see the lenses on the side and we can use a trick to simply use the other eyes image. So this part, move it here and mask it out to cover the lens. So for this, we will use the effect framing. Uh, and let's go in, you can select the framing and let's just move the layer on top. Uh, something like this and go to masking and let's just draw the mask. So this, this, something like this. Let's finish it. Now we can select these uh, three points, do some feather. When you're done, you can actually like try to move it closer to the lens, like this, and this. And now you can see that we actually removed the lens. Uh, you can also play a bit with, uh, let's say, just, you can see the doubling here. You can maybe scale it a bit down, maybe adjust the X position, let's check the scale again, and this should fit a bit better. And now we can repeat the step for the other side. So let's duplicate this. Extend the comp, let's add framing for this. Uh, go to framing, or oh, something is wrong. Uh, this framing is too big, okay. Uh, let's go to framing, let's move it to the other side, like this. Uh, we go to mask, draw mask. Select this points, do some feather, and let's adjust, adjust the positions, okay, like here, somewhere like here, and down here. So, the last step is same, so we just try to move it closer, so it overlaps, like here, and let's scale it down, okay. This should do it and you see that now we have clean footage we replaced the lenses and the next step is to do some color correction so let's add a color grade we can go in and uh, one thing that canon provided is a nice 3d lot so let's load it up and with this 3d lot we can let let's pick the white, let's pick the black, and maybe not, not that much, let's put some gamma up, and we have a really simple color correction. And the last step we do at the OVR, we actually add a, a mask for this empty space. Uh, so let's find the mask. For this, we will need uh, we will need another 3D comp, and let's put the mask at the bottom. And you can see that the result is actually just the original footage color corrected. We removed the lenses and we added like a, a mask, so we have our stand. The last step would be to render out. And for rendering, you don't need to do anything. You just keep it in original uh, resolution, no stereo, 
select some imp imp mp4 what you use and when you render out make sure that you include a ref2 in the file name and the OVR player will do everything else automatically. So that's it for the tutorial, hope you like it, see you next time, bye bye.